Guys, Longhorn for Mr. Jeremy. Uh, would have this one out to him sooner, but I actually got one in that was DOA. So that's a first. But it happens, no matter what the radio is. Striker 955, Longhorn. You'll get a bad one every now and again. So just sucks when it's a uh, high dollar one, uh, like a Longhorn. But uh, anyway, this one's ready to go for him, tuned up, ready. Output test of it before it goes out of here and uh, ships out to him. Uh, obviously great radios. If you do want to run an amp with one of these, like I talked before, you're probably going to want to run 16 pill 2879C or like a 24 pill uh, 2879 standard. Uh, all, that's if you have it tuned and everything. Now, if you like your radio stock, you can probably get by with something smaller. Uh, but if you want your radio tuned, uh, doing its optimal performance, that's about the size of amp you'll need with it. We will uh, start out on AM. Uh, test voltage is 14.8. I'll just take a look over here at the clamp meter. Hello, uh, you know, 50 amps, give or take there. Uh, put our meter on average. Uh, bottom scale. Hello. So we're all the way up. Obviously, that's probably a little too high. It's about 180 watts. Swinging 400 average. We'll back it down halfway. And that's generally a good spot to run it if you run it by itself. Hello. Still getting with it. Hello. Uh, yeah. Hello. Those low tones are really bringing it up. But usually somewhere between 300 and 400 average with it halfway. If you want to turn it all the way down, that's what you get. Hello. Uh, yeah. You know, 200 average. So our power, our average power falls off. But it doesn't absolutely kill it. Now let's just say, for the sake of our test, we set our carrier. Let's go. Let's go to 100 watts. And that's at about 10 or 11 o'clock on this radio. So what we want to do is go to sideband. See how much current it draws. Hello. You know, drawing 60. 60 amps. It's drawing more, but that's probably where I'd run it out on sideband. Uh, just so you don't get carried away, because if you turn it wide open, ooh, you know, it goes kind of crazy. It starts drawing 75, close to 80 amps. So right about in here, I'd run it on sideband and AM if you run it by itself. Now, obviously, if you run it into an amp, you'll probably end up having to drop it down a little bit. Um, Lower sideband, you know, about the same, 60 amps. Uh, PEP, why not? Audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, audio, 700. And we're going to expect close to eight on AM. So now we're back to AM. Hello, audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, audio, one, two, three, audio, audio, check, one, two, three, audio, check, one, two, three, audio, about 775. Double check the receive, make sure it works. There you go. Talk back. And uh, we can turn our echo up here. So I'm getting a little feedback, talk back up a little too high. That's it, Longhorn. Appreciate everybody. Questions, comments, shoot me a text. 423-299-3535. Rooster in Tennessee, roosterCB.com. Y'all have a good one. See you, bye.